Welcome back, Mid Missouri. We are continuing our team coverage of the winter storm hitting all across our state right now. ABC 17's Megan Drakus is live outside our station in Columbia. Now, Megan, you have some information that you got this morning from crews treating the roads. Yeah, Molly, since I last checked in with you in the 630 hour, the snow has definitely fallen. It seems like a few inches on the ground and the roads, they're even more covered. Now, Columbia Public Works does now have a 32 person crew out. Now they did switch out during the 7 a.m. hour and they will be doing 12 hour shifts. Officials do recommend that you do stay off the road, but in case you really need to do, be on those roadways this morning, you should slow down, give you some extra time and make sure that you have enough space. If you do see any plows now on the roadways, we have seen some crashes this morning and even a rollover crash with a MoDOT salt truck. But thankfully, there were no injuries reported at that crash. Now, Molly Columbia Public Works is clearing first and second priority routes now, but it will take a while because again, you can see it on my face. I'm getting pelted with the snow. It's definitely coming down really hard right now, but I am told from Columbia Public Works that the city is does have plenty of salt, so it is stocked up, so there's no worry on any salt, but kind of speaking of the roadways, and I'm going to bring in ABC Storm Track meteorologist Kevin Schneider. Kevin, when when rather should we expect that people can get on these roadways? I'm thinking it's not going to be anytime soon. Just seeing how yeah. the snow is hitting me. Yeah, again, as cold as it is, we've got that layer of sleet underneath things. Again, it is going to be a tough task to get out and clear some of those roadways. So if we can, let's just clear the schedule today. Stay off of the roads if at all possible. Likely Again, our only shot is going to be as we get into this afternoon when we pick up that break, but we've got that other round that's going to be moving in later on tonight, and that's going to be giving us another couple of inches for tomorrow morning. So this is likely going to be a, uh, an extended duration winter storm that we're going to be tracking as we get well into our Thursday, and then it gets a little bit worse from there. We've got the wind chills to deal with as we close out this work week. I'll show you just how cold it's going to feel when we come back.